How you doing guys? Mike from Phone Tech and today we're here with kind of a thing to help you out. Uh, as you know, we did get in our iPhone 3G. Um, this is the 8 gigabyte, uh, pretty good condition. Um, and we're here to show you, we're having some problems with it before. Um, it would just all of a sudden stop working. And then that worked, and I plugged back on the computer, and all right, it was okay. Uh, reloaded, and that's it. But then all of a sudden, I it stopped working during the morning, this morning, and when I plugged it in the computer, it did nothing. It actually gave these black lines, like very hairline thin black lines up and down the screen, but it were very dull. You couldn't only see it in sunlight. And then it gave, when you plug it into the wall charger, it gave the Apple logo, it would load, and then it would just go back to loading. Uh, I called somebody, one of my friends, and they said that it might be a software issue. Um, I was like, alright, so I finally got it to work. Uh, I did, I plugged it into the computer, and through the USB, and uh, it is now, I left it on there. I didn't just plug it in and say, oh, well, it doesn't work. I plugged it in for about three hours, and when I got home from where I was, where I was, uh, it was turned on. Uh, I reloaded the software, and I unplugged it, and about five minutes later, I checked it, and it did do it again. It did turn off, but it turned back on when I plugged it in. Uh, it's very odd. I had this in case on it. I did a review on this. I don't know if you saw it. Um, I don't know if that has anything to do with it. Probably not. But I'm going to go ahead and leave it on charge all night uh, in the wall charger. Not in the not in the USB charger. In the wall. And I'm going to see what happens. Uh, because this is getting a little annoying. Having no phone. And then today I had to actually switch back to the Moto Razor uh, black from nonetheless singular um, singular so that was a little annoying having an iPhone at home and uh, not being able to use it uh, that was kind of annoying um, Sorry, I'm sorry for everybody who's constantly watching uh, for the video quality change. Uh, some, some of the things I use, this camera here, the JVC Averio, and uh, some of them I use my Canon T1i. Um, for the longer videos, the Canon takes up a lot of space because it's 720, it's really nice. So that's when I tend to use the JVC. Uh, I'm going to try to go away from that and only do... Uh, some other kind of reviews I do on YouTube, uh, and just some regular uh, family videos. I'm going to stick with that for those and the Canon for the phone tech because I know uh, HD quality is a lot nicer on the Canon. So, uh, we did get some editing software in, so we're going to play around with that, and uh, we'll let you know how it goes. So, just keep watching, subscribe, and uh, have a great day.